let's get right into the, in the news. Now, yesterday, 60 Minutes correspondent Leslie Stahl revealed that in 2016, she asked Donald Trump why he attacks the press. And Trump told her he does it to discredit and demean the media so that no one believes them. <laughs> uh, this is crazy. At least in a James Bond movie, when the evil villain tells everyone his plan in detail, there's a James Bond to stop him. <laughs> like... <laughs> she said he's doing it on purpose to discredit the media. Yeah, but here's the... is she really telling the truth? I mean... <laughs> She is a member of the press. Damn it, it's working! <laughs> In other Trump news... <laughs> during a speech last night, Donald Trump tried to downplay the importance of the upcoming 2018 midterm elections. See for yourself. So your vote in 2018 is every bit as important as your vote in 2016. Although I'm not sure I really believe that, but, you know... <laughs> I don't know who the hell wrote that line. I'm not sure. <laughs> he doesn't know who wrote that line. <laughs> I never have this problem. I have a team of fantastic, well-educated, surprisingly attractive writers. <laughs> Wait, I don't know if I believe that. <laughs> who the hell wrote that line? <laughs> Although, I have to agree with him. Republican voters, wherever you are, listen to him. These midterms aren't important at all. <laughs> Electing Trump in 2016 was good enough. Sit back, enjoy the midterms, don't vote, you deserve it. <laughs> now, moving on. <laughs> it was a big day here in Los Angeles. Today, officials in West Hollywood presented Stormy Daniels the key to the city and designated the day as Stormy Daniels Day. Yeah. In honour of Stormy, the mayor asked that everyone stay home from work and have sex with someone they find utterly repulsive. <laughs> and I want to say to any men watching the ceremony where they gave Stormy the key, don't worry, that was a large, novelty-sized key. You don't have to feel bad that your keys are nowhere close to that size. <laughs> Important. And finally, we had to show you this. The Bay Area Hall of Fame in San Francisco has announced it will redo a plaque honouring a soccer star, um, honouring the soccer star Brandy Chastain, after people complained that it didn't look like her. Um, I'm going to let you be the judge. <laughs> It doesn't look like the artist was sculpting brandy as much as it looked like the artist was drinking brandy. <laughs> Can we see it again? <laughs> look at that. <laughs> Even the plaque looks like she knows how bad it is. <laughs> it doesn't look like one of the greatest women soccer players of all time. It doesn't even look like a woman. <laughs> It looks more like me than it does Brandy Chastain. <laughs> Look. <laughs> so let me take this opportunity to say how honoured I am to be inducted into the Bay Area Hall of Fame. Thank you for having me.